I'm here about the deal with Flavia. Flavia? Tell him I still don't have the goods. Five wolf skins and five boar skins. No more, no less. And I'll only take the complete delivery. Here are the skins Flavio promised. Yeah, let's see. Yes, yes, these look good. Can we do business? We have a deal. I'll take the furs, you take the meat. I do not wish to be bothered right now. teach me the basics of alchemy? For you? Of course, of course, no problem. What potions do you have? Show me what you have. Now who could teach me to pick locks? Good luck out there.
Try someplace else. Hey, you. Where do you think you're going? What business is it of yours? Hey, I was just messing with you. Gets a bit boring around here. Well, apart from the rot worms. I'd stay on the walkway and not go too far out into the swamp. Believe me, being eaten by those creatures is not the way a man should go. Hang on. I think I've got a map somewhere you can have. Although by the looks of you, you could do with a better weapon. Did you come from Harbour Town? What's it like there now? Why are you interested? Well, it used to be my home for one. And I heard the white robes are gaining the upper hand there. Seems that way. Oh well, we'll survive. Somehow. We always do. Where can I get a better weapon? Depends on what you're after. Some swear by a good blade. Others prefer the heft of an axe. I'm a hunter, so I favour a bow and arrow. I've got a couple of nice specimens here, actually. For the right price, I'm sure I could part with one or two. What do you hunt in the swamp? Less and less. There are only a few beasties. They may look unappetising, but you'd be surprised what our cook can do. About the only thing left big enough to feed us all is this large worm over to the west. But he's a big fella. I really need help to take him down. Probably a bit of help to keep him down after I've eaten him too. I've killed that worm. You don't need to worry about it. One less worm is no bad thing. Here, have 30 gold for your trouble. One less worm is no bad thing. Here, have 30 gold for your trouble. I'm new around here. Got swept in with the tide. What can you tell me about this place? Ah, I see. Well, then there are a few things you should know. This whole swamp area, from here to the temple in the north, is run by Don Esteban, our leader. I wouldn't mess with him if I were you. He's got some fighters working for him that'd break your jaw as happy as look at you. What can you tell me about the temple? Came up from the ground about the time these storms started, and all these beasts came out of it. Never seen the light before. Indescribable they are. Our fighters soon sorted them out. I doubt there's much still alive in there. Well, apart from the Don. He's moved into the temple now. Don't see him very often. No one really knows what he's doing in there. Me? I say hunt, kill and don't ask too many questions. What's the biggest thing you've hunted? The number of times I've been asked that. I suppose it was one of the rotworms out here. But it doesn't always have to be big to be dangerous. Let's trade. Put that thing in. Ah. Ah. Rejected! Ah. Ah. Yeah.
for me. You don't look like the rest of the Don's men. Me? I'm the one the rest of them treats like dirt. Day in, day out, me and my workers try our best. And they need us, the bosses. But do they realize that? I wish they'd come and see what it's like. See if they like being eaten by swamp worms. I heard there was a spy around here. A spy? A spy for who? That's the last thing we need. People will start suspecting each other, blaming each other. Great, something else has gone wrong. Well, keep your eyes open. That's the quite one. a weapon. <laughs> Quiet, I'm thinking. I don't like faces I don't know well, and your face is too pretty. Slap some makeup on you and you could work the brothels. Hey, did you see a big guy with an axe come this way? What are you talking about? This camp's full of big men with axes. Hey. Lost, are you? Don't you worry about it. I'll take care of you. I'm not lost. I'm just having a look around. You're a stranger and you're snooping. Either of which can help you find a blade eager for your blood. Got it? Are you 
you the local blacksmith? Blacksmith? I look like I spend my days making fucking old shoes. I'm a pewterer, a gilder, a worker of fine metal. Hmm, your work here is not too bad, but I've seen better. You've seen better? And you're an expert, are you? You wouldn't know decent metal work if someone shoved it up your ass and wiggled it around. You want to look again and reassess your thoughts? Or you want me to show you some really close up? I'm looking for new weapons. Looking is for losers. Paying gets you the goods. Have you got any sword blanks? It's just what I got here. My stock of ore is empty. You bring me some iron ore, I can make you some blanks. What have you got to trade? You're going to stand here all day? Waif and stray looking for pity? Or fortune hunter looking for gold? Looks like I've got another mouth to feed. How are things, Rachel? Don't act like you don't know what's been going on around here. You know our attempt to take Harbour Town failed. Why else do you think everyone is in such a lousy mood? If I were you, I wouldn't be seen in this camp. This is a friendly morning. Next time it won't be so friendly. So is that the way things are? Looks like it. Unless you have something important to say, I suggest you make yourself scarce. Too risky. Did I look like I wanted to talk to you? The men in the camp say you've never won a fair fight. What's the point of a fair fight? You stick by the rules, you get beaten, or dead, or you become a white robe. I'd rather be dead than that. I'm sure lots of people would prefer you dead than in a white robe. You know what I think? I think sarcasm is going to get you killed. Put that thing away! About time. I'm watching you. Put that thing away! Put your damned weapon away! Ah! 
kill him! Uh, after them! You won't get out of here alive! Don't let the murderer escape! Harbour Town. I don't feel like talking to anyone right now. Least of all you. Shove off. Any news? Well, apart from me having bunions the size of hen's eggs, no. Been pretty quiet. Hope it stays that way. Put that thing away! Put down your weapon, you crazy fool! You want trouble? You got it!
what's happening? <laughs> <laughs> here, right? It's that easy to tell. Ah. Uh, Don's boys already got on your nerves, eh? They're just bored. No imagination, you see. What do you do here? I tend the Bruegelweed here on Robar's farm. It's not the most noble of plants, but it's versatile. You can brew beer with it. You can, should you be of a mind, smoke it as well. The smoke has special properties if you know what I mean. What do you know about the Don? I know enough not to mess with him. We used to be out here all alone until they swept in and took the place over. But stick to his rules and he's a good man, if a hard taskmaster. Working in the fields isn't easy, but it gets you away from people. Space to think. Can you sell me some weed or beer? Surely can. And I have more to sell as well, if you're interested. Who is Robar? He's a salt-of-the-earth fellow. He farms this swamp. Well, this field. What do you have to sell? What do you think about Don Esteban? You can say what you like about the Don. But he's never left us in the lurch. What? Are you one of the fighters here? I am out here. But when we were in the town, well, sleight of hands more my thing. Combats for boneheads. I have a few real skills. Sneaking, opening locks, picking pockets, proper honor skills, no violence needed. Sounds good. I want to be a better thief. Can you teach me how to open locks? Of course. Many locks. There. But.
Is this your land? It's me that founds it. Then I use the Bruegel weed that grows here to make beer. What can you tell me about the area around here? You haven't been here long, have you? Let's see. Well, the boys in the camp all work for Don Esteban. They're collecting everything they can find made of gold. The Don must have a fortune in that temple by now. Do you work for the Don? Me? <laughs> I've been on this farm all my life. One day, these ruins rise up out of the ground, all over the place. Then Don Esteban comes here. At least he keeps these creatures from the temple away. Where did the gold the Don's collecting come from? From those temple ruins, the ones that rose from the ground. They say there are treasures there, and creatures. Could you teach me to make beer? I suppose, if you have a basic knowledge of alchemy, but it would take you years to learn properly. What's Bruegel weed? They call it a weed, but it's not. Mostly grows in the swamp or along rivers. But you can find it most anywhere. Looks useless, but you can't get hops out here. Well, not cheap, you can't. And this stuff will do the trick. Maybe I could help you... Good. I could all, if you... Hey, you grow... I grow Bruegel to sell it. There's no other way to... Again. That wasn't it. 